the last of the control sources we'll consider is the current controlled current source okay and it's denoted by the symbol an input short circuit branch to sense the current between n1 and n2 and an output current source which is a dependent current source whose current is dependent on this ix so this current is given by k times ix where k is as you realize a dimensionless number because it multiplies a current to give you a current okay you can think of this as the counterpart of the voltage controlled voltage source a voltage controlled voltage source gives you a scaled voltage and a current controlled current source gives you a scaled current okay and again from this relationship it's obvious that this is linear okay and what it means is that if you drive a current controlled current source by a current source so let's say we have a current controlled current source defined to be 5 times the input current and i drive it with 1 milliamps i connect this to some arbitrary circuit this causes a current of 5 milliamps to flow here okay so that's what is meant by a current controlled current source now as before uh, when you use it in a circuit so i'll take the same example circuit i had done with the current controlled voltage source let's say i had 1 volt and 10 kilo ohms then i can define this current to be ix and i can define a current controlled current source to be 5 times ix okay and this could be connected to any circuit and because ix equals 0.1 milliamps this causes 0.5 milliamps to flow through the circuit okay so that's a current controlled current source it's a control source whose value depends on a current elsewhere in the circuit okay now all these control sources as i mentioned are unilateral that is you have a controlling quantity and that results in the control quantity you cannot use it in the other direction okay